Sorry that I look a bit messy today. Tonight I have a concert to go to. It is the Silhouettes, which is the all girls group here. So I'm pretty excited about that. Um, I'll miss the all guys group, the Yakafellas, because they're performing the same day that we are, which sucks and is a really jerk move for them to pull. But, um, oh, well. oh and last night I went to see Little Women. It was about the same, except that the transition scenes had some people in them, you know, things like that. But um, overall, I was, I was pretty happy about it. Uh, some of the characters were a lot different, like Philippa Kerr was a lot sweeter of a Beth than this girl was. Oh, you know what was funny? Is that like half the people were trying really hard to be musical theater, like very like poorly done Kristen Chenoweth, and the other half of the people were trying to be operatic. And Sorry, Little Women is neither of those. Like, it doesn't matter that one of the songs is called an operatic tragedy. It's not an opera. And just because you make your voice nasal doesn't mean you sound like Kristen Chenoweth. Tomorrow, I'm planning on spending a lot of money because I'm probably going to go downtown and buy some things. And then also, Jack Spade is having a sale. That's where I got my book bag from. And it's a 30% off sale and it's only today and tomorrow and I'm probably going to spend be spending a lot of money that I don't have. Now I'm going to read a list of things I think are interesting and comment on some of them. People making blogs. Why does everyone make blogs nowadays? A lot of people just keep on making blog posts every couple weeks. I'm sorry I don't update this enough. I'm sorry that I don't update this enough. And then they like write three words and then they're done. Or try to be extra insightful. Especially when it's not insightful. Comedies that end in death. Case in point, the one that I just read. It's supposed to be a comedy it's by some Russian man. But then, like, an old man dies at the end because they leave him at their house and they move out of their house and lock all the doors and then he's still there and he's like, oh, I guess everyone left me. And then he dies. And then he says nincompoop. Some animals. The main animal I think is funny is the giraffe. The reason is, apparently they don't have vocal cords. So I don't know if they just like, whistle all day. <laughs> Can you imagine giraffe just walking around like whistling to each other? I feel like that would be really great. Smart water. Smart water tastes like nothing. It's like just drinking wet. Plant names. You know exactly what I'm talking about. You know exactly what list of plant names I'm talking about. Dorian Mode. My friend has a cat named Dorian, who is also funny and half blind. Finally, I have a voice audition next week. I think I'm going to be singing Love is Here to Stay by George Gershwin and Ira Gershwin because that songbook is one of the only ones I have here and I don't feel like looking up something. I like that song and that's what I'm going to sing. And I know the intro, and most people don't know the intro, so I'm hoping that will get me brownie points. Okay, well, I will see you later, and I'm so proud of you for your fine arts performances. I'm so happy that you got so many prizes. Good job! See you later. Bye.